It's lovely. Um, what are you up to? <laughs> what are you up to? That's a huge plan you have. It is a huge plan you have. But you know, you know very well, you have to leave something behind. Okay? The old has to go. The old has to go. I think you are absolutely happy letting it go. Look, look. You're so happy letting it go. Look at yourselves. You're dancing around. You're, you're dancing around here. You're dancing around here. And you're letting it go. Happily, that is. Um, many of you will let go their old home, probably, because of a brand new one. Many of you might let go um, your uh, their, their, their old office and replace it with a brand new one. Whatever this is, it's a lovely... Look, you have the sun, you have death, you have the fool, you have the strength and the temperance. So many major kind of cards, major change, major change. Four of Pentacles and Four of Wands next to each other, plus the Fool. A brand new beginning. A brand new beginning, Kina. I mean, I have to be honest. I really feel for many of you, because we have the Ten of Pentacles and we have the Four of Pentacles here and the brand new beginning and the house in the middle. For many of you, this is just a home buy. You probably either start saving or you have been saving and you buy or you find the, the right home and you have to, I mean, certainly many of us, when we have to buy a new home, the finances get a bit short then. We have the certain amount, we buy the home, we are over the moon and we are happy. But the one thing that we have to do then is to tighten the belt again, to start saving again because... We are basically blank then. So this is the only stagnation that I see. It's a, it's a brand new, it's a major new beginning. Major new beginning for you. Some of you might get engaged. Some of you might simply get engaged and start um, putting some money aside for the, for the wedding, really. Either way, though, it is something that you really, really, really wanted, always wanted. And um, finally, you can start making it happen. Now, we have two cards that speak of patience. It Don't think that because now you left the old behind, the old way of living behind, and you started the new, you will not need to be patient and you will not need to be calm and um, safe. Quite to the contrary. These two cards are telling us, look, in, the, in particular in the month of um, uh, August, before we get into Virgo, okay? This is the month of Virgo and this is the month of August still talking to us. Now, uh, of the month of, what am I saying? This is the end of August. This is when we go into Virgo. And this is same month of August, but before that, when we are, when we're in Leo. Patience is required. A lot of it. And uh, there is one more message for you. It's like, use your best language when you're dealing with, with finances in um, August. Patiently, like a, you, be like a mother, like a mother or father, like a parent, talking to their children in the most, no matter how furious you're inside, in a very calm manner. Imagine you are talking to your uh, naughty kid and uh, they've done something and, and you're I mean, you've got to stay calm. You have to use polite language, calm, and be patient. That's that. It, the rest is uh, pretty much green light. But 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 because the, the point of looking into the cards is, 
Okay, you had a question. Well, will I make it? Will I make it happen? Will I be able? Will I get the courage to leave the old behind and make that step? You will make the step. You you are making the step. You're on the cliff. You're on the on the edge. You're making this, and you are not alone. You have friends. You have a little friend here. You're not alone. You're not alone here. You have a little friend. You're not alone here. You have another friend. You're not alone here. You have another friend. You're not alone here. So you're not alone. You're not doing this alone. You won't be able to do it alone, but you will make it. You will make it. However, though, you're the one who has to make the step forward and just jump off the roof. And then no one else can do that for you, but there are people to catch you. There are people with you that will hold your hand, that will uh, be with you, stay with you, but you have to make your, that one step. And you are making it. I see you making it. I mean, everything is in the upright. Uh, it's, uh, it is a wish of yours. It's, it's like, Tell me, August, it's pretty much saying, hey, tell me, what's your wish? So what is your wish now? Tell me what's your wish and I will make it come true. One little wish, give it to me. And the answer is yes. Will I, will I be able to make that step? That's my wish. I wish to be, to, to be able to, to make myself make the step. Yes, you will do it. And um, you will be brave enough and it will be amazing. You will feel amazing, actually. I think you will start really saving. You will either start saving for a house, as I say, or uh, for, um, for a wedding. Many of you probably for a wedding. One way of living. I mean, if you get engaged, obviously you will have to start living together. And that means living together is the cooperation. And then you start saving because that's your next plan. And then you have to get patient. Okay, now we are a couple. It's official. You, we are not even a couple. We are a family even now. And now we have to start saving and be patient and balance the temperance, balance out the whole situation. So one day, one day, very soon, it's only the beginning though, we will make our wish come true and that's a, a home of our own and um, all of that. As I say, some others are simply buying a home. They're simply buying a home. Maybe maybe you're just leaving your old house and you're happily moving with all your family. Yes, of course. We have to then start being uh, more cautious with, with our finances and balance things when, when, um, if, when, when we don't have this much in the bank account anymore because we spend everything on a house. Well, of course, we have to start being again more, more, more careful with finances, saving again, being more patient with one another because lack of um lack of finances is um can can sometimes make us nervous of course uh, most of the time actually that's what it makes us um i mean if you have been looking for a home and you couldn't find a home this will be the the moment when you find it this will be the moment when you find it. This will, it will happen to actually, it will happen actually quite quickly even. I won't be surprised if it happens quickly. You find it and you go for it and it's, it's like, ta-da, I did it. Suddenly I did it. Um, let's have a drink. Let's go to my new place and have a drink and, um, It, it really is a, is a wish of yours to get there, to get to that engagement, to get to that new property, to get to that new office even. Um, although it's not really indicated as a job, you may simply be running your own uh, business from 
we or maybe you have been running your own business uh from from a certain place and now suddenly you can expand we have the ten of pentacles ten of pentacles speaks of really finances are suddenly amazing one once we have um ten of pentacles and then on the other hand we have the four of pentacles which is a bit of a controversial you know because this speaks of saving and this speaks of earning a lot or having a lot so why not you may start earning a lot and start saving as well but it will be a i think this is something brand new this is something that you have never done before you may i mean you may have been running your business until now somehow from home from here and there and suddenly now you can expand you can have an office now suddenly you can have that big office that you always wanted to have um and and you will make it you will make it happen it's just happening the sun is shining the sun is shining but the focus for you really is that this card in the middle which is connected to either property or engagement no matter how we look at it this is what it is now property as i said can be anything it can be an apartment a house um uh, and, or, uh, what else do we have? Even a boat, houseboat, but it's something where we live. Those are the four uh, pillars of our own uh, home. Or, but it it can as well uh, indicate engagement. Engagement where when you get engaged, you have to leave the old way of living your bachelor, your bachelor way of living. I think you're doing it quite happily. Look how happy you are doing it. You don't mind at all. You're not sad of living, for living your, your way, uh, your old way behind. And, um, oh, that's amazing. Really, Virgos, who would have, uh, who would have thought? As I say, however, I know, I don't say it, the cards are saying it. Patience is required. It will be amazing, it will be overwhelming, probably even overwhelming, but patience and good language are required. Okay? Leaving this old thing behind. Don't try to, don't explode. Don't, you, you, loads of uh, calm words will be needed whatever that is, to leave the old behind. Many, many calm words and patience will be needed. Um, so you can part on good terms, whatever that is. You can part on good terms with your previous landlord. You can part with on good terms with your previous, um, um, I don't know, um, uh, office um, situation or um, to to sell the I don't know maybe leaving your new old job and, and getting into your new office but leaving the old job means you have to really be careful to do that in a calm relaxed manner uh, maybe a little detached Suggestion is maybe you should be a little detached. Don't get emotional. Uh, be be rather detached, like a piggy bank. You see, you pop something, it stays there. It doesn't come out again unless you break the piggy bank. You don't want to break the piggy bank. Not not in August. Be patient. Use your use your intelligence to deal with it. For that is the best way to leave the old behind. You will be very happy. Either way, you will feel amazingly happy. You will, it's just like, a, yes, that's what I wanted. I want to make that step now and I'm going to make it happen and it will happen. So good luck, my dear Virgos. I really, really do like it. Um, it's a major thing coming up.